we're done. We've taken fill out of a two, let's see, two foot deep, 16 foot diameter hole for the pool that you just saw there. And then we've dug about, um, about 21 holes that are somewhere between two foot by two foot by two foot um, and 2.5 cubed. And we've used all of that up in this wall here. So you can see uh, the rocks that got left over. We'll put some of those back in the holes. And the bumps, the bump outs are about two feet high, and the back wall ranges between about 42 and 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 40 inches. And this pool is now two feet deep, and um, there's about 4,400 gallons in there. And it will have insulation on top of it. It has it three inches below, and it's insulated along the sides too. That'd be a part of how we feed in here. There's some soil that we brought in. Um, there's another eight cubic yards outside. And that will be mixed with this clay down in here to uh, create the right soil conditions for the citrus and avocado trees. I had the soil analyzed and, and uh, an amendment was made. So now we cover the walls, well I am covering the walls in the night time, and sunny days, a loose covering so it dries slowly. There's still a bit of um, tamping to do along the sides. And then we'll get at the plastering. There's uh, still all the tree holes to be dug in this area and then on the other side. And we'll put aside some of the clay at the bottom for plastering.